Hi everybody, welcome back. Thank you for checking out this video. It means a lot if you'd be so kind as to perhaps just leave a like and a comment down below. That would also be very appreciated and it would sort of help analytically. You know, help people see the video, help the video get uh, recommended to other people, etc, etc. So for this video I am going to be working on that middle one. I finished the pink guy, or John Marshall, that's his name. Uh, come back to me eventually. Uh, I'm doing Hagar, Lusum Hagar, and I'll do the last guy, I can't even pronounce his name, um, the blue one, in the next video. So I'm right outside City Hall. I'll uh, head on up and see what she wants. Beneath the surface, this is called. Now I'm just going to make a prediction here. Maybe this quest involves her wanting me to become mayor and she's the one who has to go out into the wasteland and shoot people up whilst I sit here and do paperwork. What do you think the chances are of that actually happening? I think they're pretty high. I'm confident that they're pretty high. What have you got? So, what you got for me, Hagar? The Feltrite fission cores have been stripped from all the old machines. Clegg must have used them to power his idiotic tower. We need another power supply if we want that tank to run. You mentioned some good news? Yeah, the gizmo you planted worked like a charm. Listen to this, straight off of Clayton's computer. I am at my rope's end with you, Clayton. I have been more than patient. I have given you endless support, yet you have not delivered on your end. I am beginning to think that Clegg Clayton is not the powerhouse of a man he claims to be. I shall give you one last chance to explain. Consider yourself summoned. Go to the Goliath plant. There you will receive further instructions. That voice. That conceited goddamn zombie relish. I'd know it anywhere. Did we get the coordinates? Please tell me you got the coordinates. That we did. It's an area called Twin Falls, a bandit roost currently held by the Goon Squad. I'm starting to think these low-rent thugs are in deep with the authority. Would explain all that impressive equipment. If this Goliath plant is any kind of authority base, hidden under some bandit hideout camouflage, then I bet we can find all the felt vision cores we need there. You read my mind. I'll follow the coordinates, see what I can dig up. Good They're luck, actually Walker. called... They're actually called Goon Squad as well. Like, what's with these Watch names? Back. I can't tell if it's like meant to be like that, because this one has kind of got that comedic sense to it. You know, that sort of like everything's wacky and just a bit weird, blah blah blah, which the first game didn't have, but it was wacky and weird. Like hell, the the bad guys are called the Authority. Yeah. And they they call themselves that as well, like a straight face. They're quite proud of that name. So yeah, I, I think this one works a lot better. The, the tone and everything works a lot better. Uh, right, let's go and see the cyber duck. Come in. I stand ready to modify you further. Uh, what am I missing though? No. I can't tell what I'm missing. Yeah, no idea what that is from the end. Keep your head about you out there. But yeah, I think the tone of this is a lot better. It's it's the marker more often than not. It's the champ. Saw you on the killing screen. Killer. Okay, where am I going? I'm going. Up there. Aha, up here. That's a hell of a... That's not too bad of a drive. I've noticed the map makes it look a lot further. 
I got distance, like, makes, yeah, the map makes the distance seem a lot further than it actually is. It's actually not that bad. Uh, which is kind of unfortunate. I do like big maps. I mean, I love The Witcher 3's map. I love that game yes, so much. But this Gumball one's doozy. quite small. Hell, I, I think it's smaller than Far Cry New Dawn's map, and that was tiny. Road choker up ahead. They've learned their lesson. I assume that the end game is going to take place. Cause I'm, I think this is like the last part of the map. This is the top part of the map, which I barely gone to. So I assume your lucky day. this is where the end game is going to be. Unless there's a brand new, like map, I haven't seen yet. I mean that's po that's possible. I'm not ruling that out. I think Far Cry New Dawn did something like that. The end the end game was on a part. Was it on a map that you couldn't access in free mode? Or you couldn't get to anyway? So I would have thought that they done something similar for this. Another authority sentry. Ah. Here's one of them bandit dens again. Wait, am I almost there? Yeah. Cool. I don't know if this is good or bad game design. That map, that's, that like that little part there. Some of the terrain is just horrendous. 
Ooh. I don't know if it's meant to be designed that way. Okay, Lucem, I'm here at Twin Falls, keeping my eyes peeled for any signs of authority presence. Alright, let me know if you find anything. Whoa. There's one guy left. Don't know where he is. But he's throwing grenades at me all the time. Anything? Nope, not yet. I'll keep looking. God, it's a yeah, it's a loud evening in my house tonight. I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep like track of uh, the of the mics on or not. Or can you shouting on the side of the door? Uh, ragu? Someone just say ragu. I don't know where I'm going. Just want to point that out. That seems to be a common theme in this game. Oh, hello.
just gonna guess and say he's with the authority. Hagar, there's some kind of gate opening leading into the mountain. Bet this is it. Yeah, I'm going in to find out. Oh yeah, you got the crap shack out there and then you got this, which looks like an alien base on XCOM. Look at that, Clegg Clayton's little chopper. Wait, can we fly on this? No, okay. Because I know there's a vehicle that looks similar to that in the loadout menu. Like when you call in a vehicle. Titanic mutant monsters here. They may be preparing for more attacks like Vineland's. Come in, Walker. Hello? Fuck. Breaking up. Okay, let's just get this vision core and get the hell out of here. Please give me the creeps. I'm gonna need a little of that back on you so generously promised. Uh, a little extra something something for me and I'll get you what you need. A deal, Cross. Let me remind you that I will let you in as soon as I take the mayor's seat. Oh, your little dream of becoming mayor. I appreciate your dedication, Mr. Clayton, but let me assure you that was never going to happen. You made me a promise. <laughs> you lied to me. <laughs> to Clay Clayton, you lied. I would have preferred to take Wellspring quietly. But blood and thunder will have to do. But I am Clegg Clayton! Aim away from his face. I want to preserve his what? cadaver as a memento. What? No, I, I can go for whatever he's paying. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, you could have been the richest mutants in the wasteland. Go, go! So, wait, they set him up? They set him up and he wasn't even like a boss or anything. They just kill him. Because I, I got the feeling from the first few missions that he was going to be like a boss. You know, like a boss battle.
I get the feeling our side in this war didn't do a great job of destroying the authority. They seem to have bases nearly everywhere. And it's not like they were hiding this one. This one's just, you can see it in the cliff face. This is just that moment when you realise perhaps you're on the side of the idiots. This place is huge. Oh, of course, yeah, they're building a massive mutant. Gotta get across. Ah, the felt tried to speed. I was like, I can make that but I couldn't I couldn't make it. Ah, this one again. Well, I've been here before. Oh, ah, I forgot I got the. I, yeah. Forgot I had this one. Ah, I'm dead anyway. I've only got like 15 health. Ah, there, there you go. Ah, it was so close. It was so close. Oh, well, hopefully the checkpoint's not too far. Hopefully the checkpoint's at the start of that room. Just as I walk in. Yeah, so it is.
Ah, go to the gun to cool down. been terminated. Oh, there's a lot of people in this. A lot of mutants, I should say. I'm trying to remember if Feltrite was a thing in the first game. I don't believe it was. Or it might have been, but not to this extent. Oh, wait, what? Because I've heard Feltrite at least like 60 times an hour playing this. Oh, I've seen it on my stream about that much. It's working. Now for the other one. Uh huh. I don't understand what's going on there.
Archers are down. Let's grab the core and go. Hey, that was lucky. Happening? What am I doing? I don't know what's going on. Oh, what was going on? Ah, oh, it was just—it was just told me to get out of there. And when I hit the elevator, it turned around. There's like a whole sea of those guys. What? Just a little bit of warning would have been nice. There's just going to be more guys up there, I think. They don't seem that sort of interested in self-preservation. Mayor Hagar, do you copy? Lost you there for a while. What you got? Well, I got the fission core. Also, Clegg Clayton is dead. You killed him? No. General Cross gave the order via video uplink. Those armless freaks just gunned him down. But Clegg was working for Cross. Was being the key here. Cross was none too happy with Clegg's lack of progress. He was backing him to become mayor and open the gates of Wellspring for his hordes. Which explains the assassination attempt. Oh, yeah. But Cross grew sick of waiting. Figured Clegg took him for a ride. He's coming for your city now, Mayor. Not if we come for him first. Bring me that vision cord. We'll get the Predator tank up and running. Dagger is bringing this war to Cross's doorstep. Um, uh, can I not? Okay, I, oh, I don't understand. Why can't I fast travel? Maybe I just have to get away from that location or this location. Okay, let's try now. No. Oh. All right. See running all the way back there, or driving rather, or running. I mean, who knows? I can come into all. I can come into all sorts of trouble driving around on these roads. Okay, so I assume she's going to give me whatever the hell she's been working on, because I can't quite remember. I remember questioning what you know what the hell that piece was floating in Marshall's hideout, but 
can't quite remember what Lusum was doing. I can smell the slime bubble on your breath here. There is a car that you can unlock by doing Hagar's missions, so maybe I unlock the car? Maybe? Let's find out. Make it quick, Range. Hagar, I got the Feltrite Vision Core. So we can finally get the Predator tank up and running. There we go, that's the vehicle. New vehicle unlock. The Xerxes Mark III. Good news, Walker. The Predator tank is a go. Mean, lean, and beautiful. Now, we're just lacking one final ingredient. Find Dr. Anton Kvasir. He has the puzzle piece we need to get Dagger up and running. I'm on it. Alright, so... Just, just in after the last guy now. Well, that's pretty much it, I think, for this video. I'll call it to an end. So that is the second part of Dagger Project done. I've only got one left. Um, heading over to his now in the next part, in the next episode of Be It Is Camp. Hope you're all enjoying the walkthrough so far. Hope the commentary is okay, if not good. Or at least better than my earlier attempts at commentary. Uh, if you made it to this part of the video, God bless you, thank you, it means a lot. Uh, if you could just leave a like and a comment, that would be help me out there. That would help out a great deal. Thank you very much. Other than that, I hope you have a good day and I'll see you next time.